welcome back to the channel welcome to the bush tv okay ladies and gents in this one i'm going to change the window module or the electric window module on the driver's side of the 80 it's been giving me a bit of grief for a while now i replaced all the switch and it wasn't that i've tested all the wiring it's all perfect so it's actually the motor that's failed so i did replace the switch guys under there it's a brand new one and it's not that so now we've got a spare so to take off the trim lot guys you pop out this it's nice and easy this pops out there's two screws under there there's another screw just up under here there's one screw in there i reckon every 80 series has got that broken it's a bit of a pain this part here that just pops out you got to be careful i actually broke the top of it but oh well like i said it's an old car things are pretty brittle all the way around there's those little clips in there so you just go around and unpop it all and then lift up the door trim and take it off all right so i've taken the trim off guys it's only a couple of screws one there two on the armrest this thing comes off and then you sort of unclip the whole door trim i'll show you that later with these clips some of them break because this car's pretty old right the plastic was all intact so i ripped off the bits that i need there's six bolts that hold in the module there's one two three four five six they're 10 mil and underneath there in the window part which is up right now which i've got to wind it down there's a rail that runs across in there and they're two 10 mil bolts as well so you can see it doesn't work my dilemma was guys that i had to bang the window to get it to work actually Bang it and then it stops. So we need to go down. Okay, that'll do. So there's one in there. If you can see through the hole, 10 mil. There's the other one hiding just in there. That's like the rail that holds that window on. goes back together as easy as it comes apart not usually the case with this type of thing all right so the window should be loose and that frame yep it is should actually slide up and down and it does so what i might do let's get it up there it doesn't drop down on me. What I might do is tape it up. All right, so I just re-taped the window because it just came off. You know, it took my fingers off in there. And these are like very old. This car's the 95 model, so the really is pretty old. Dropping this one's loose. There's one. We have six of these. Reverse the process, the new one's got grease, which is really good.
se ve una pinza. Okay, good boys for now. So we can get them all in properly. Alright, so that was the, it was a bit tight that one, but we got it in. Just have to use this. That one's on, it's still loose, just there. So they're all pretty loose. What we do now is nip it up and then give it a go. See if it winds up and down nice, and uh, we'll put it all back together. Get these windows on first. One, two. Okay, so looks pretty good. Just to nip it all up nice. Flash. Make sure it's all in the rail proper. Okay, so here's a bit of a test. I'm going to try it. Well, look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Perfect. There we go. And up again. Excellent. Now, funny enough, I'll leave it up now. I'll tell you what, there was a story because even I even replaced that thinking it was this that was broken. So that's brand new. It was off eBay. It wasn't too much, actually. It was pretty cheap. So now I've got a spare one of these, this is a new one. So. Anyway, so I think it was about 130 bucks. You buy the motor, that's a couple of hundred, so that job's done. All I gotta do is clean it all up, put it back together, and we're done here. Final test. Make sure nothing's in the way. I think that wire's a bit in the way. I might cable tie it somewhere. So there. Some of these clips are a bit broken. Just slides down. Like so. Okay, so I snapped the top off that when I took it off. Just fits on the here, it's a bit of a... Everything's a little brittle, so like I said, she's a pretty old car. It's got this that goes in a little, little hole here. Okay, that's on. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. So there you go. Pretty basic. Look at that. I'm not, I'm not going to know myself. Unbelievable. Oh, well, guys, thanks for watching. Hope this helps. Like I say in every video, I'm not a mechanic, but I do most of these things myself on this vehicle. So I got away. I didn't even pinch my fingers on this thing. So it's pretty lucky. There's the old one. It's not even any good for a spare, so it's going straight to the bin. So once again, guys, thanks for watching. Check out the channel, check out the content. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the thumbs up and drop a comment. See you in the next one.